so hi guys welcome to yet another youtube video my name is barbara and here we do a lot of lifestyle content so according to the title of the video it's a haul, and this time it's a cucumber haul. so we have like two hauls in one video and i'll start off by the deco stuff that i thrifted they are quite just a few deco stuff that i thrifted then we are going to finish it off with some beddings then i guess you'll call it a video so if you are a new viewer karibu sana to the family if you are not subscribed and you are a new viewer or you are a returning viewer and you have not subscribed kindly please do subscribe we are growing we are growing and i'm glad that you find this platform helpful with plugs with recipes with making your homes look fabulous and on a budget and to the returning subscribers thank you so much for returning for those who like my videos thank you so much as in i feel feel so good when we get to interact even with a like or a comment thank you so much for that so let's start off with the thrifted home deco and i'm not so sure about the direction because sometimes you might take a kikomba matatu and they might take uh, another route so i don't know which route that will take so the bed sheet being on the left and those other wheelbarrows with water view things that they sell on your right behind that you can just see people sell quite a number of thrifted items like the video you have seen i'll be sure to be leaving a contact of that guy down in the description uh, let me show you exactly what you can find from the guy in Gikomba, like the thrifted items home deco. They are quite a number of things that you can find. So let me take you to that short video and then be right back and show you exactly what I thrifted.
saved quite a number of things from there. So let me show you exactly what I got. Just a few items. So he wraps them pretty well with um, newspaper. So this is how it looks like. It's just a small and light blue bus. This one was 200 shillings. For sure, I'll spray paint this because it doesn't match the living room aesthetics. Either white, black, or mustard. Not so sure what. So we have started uh, like thrifting uh, deco items for the console table. That's the first item. So the camera. So this is the other one. It's just a small um it's like a candle holder this one is a bit heavy this one was 150 shillings so that is how it looks like so this one will remain in its original uh, form and color so that is how it looks like the other item is this character. it's also a vase but it has a design So the idea on the console table is having different shapes and designs. So the plan is to have this one here, like that, on the console table. And I'll definitely put something in here, probably papa grass, pampa grass, papaya grass. Those, those grass, those, the, the, that grass. I'm sure to be leaving a video of. Oh, I'll leave a photo here of the, the grass I'm talking about. So the short ones will be nice. Or some flowers. Not so sure what, cause I have seen the grass that I'm talking about. They fall out, and also, it will remain, in the same, color. Yes the same color the same shape and not planning to spray paint it this one is another one and this one is the last like thrifted item that i got it's cute very cute so that is how it looks like it's also of us this is how it looks like also also planning to put something here not so sure what but once we get to know what uh, I'll take you guys through it am I planning to spray paint it definitely probably uh, white yes this one will be like white so i'll spray paint it or i'll paint it i think i'll paint it so that it has like texture but we are going to do a diy with you guys so this one was uh 800 shillings And that is the end of the things that I, um, no, 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 no. Now this one is the last one that we thrifted. This one was 350 shillings. This one. This one is pretty large compared to the ones that are new uh, that you can find in Kamukonji or in your favorite Instagram stores. This one is quite, uh, quite large. And this one, I'm planning uh, to do my bathroom, um, makeover thing for the master bathroom and this one will go there to hold my uh shower gels 
and body scrubs and some and quite a number of things that i have in my bathroom so this one this one will hold quite a number of things it only came one thing with thrifted items you might find one uh, uh thing and i wish there were quite a number so i would have taken quite a number but i only got this one and those were it how cute how cute are these thrifted items how cute how cute so those are the thrifted items so let's do the beddings and i'll start off with the bed sheets and before i do that i'll also be including the guy's number the previous haul that i did of beddings i bought them from this guy that actually shifted places i managed to i didn't i didn't manage to get that guy at Kikomba, but once i do get because i'll sure be going back to the cover and if i do get uh, his number i'll link them but this time round, i got a number from the guy that i bought uh, the stuff from and i'm sure to be leaving uh, his number down in the description kindly please uh, go check that out so let's start with the beddings so i only added two white beddings Two white beddings, 200 shillings each. These are just normal white beddings. Seven by six. Two hundred shillings each. So let's do the pillow cases. What I'm planning to do with my um, the pillows that I have, I'm planning to change the pillows. Actually, one set of pillow I'm planning to change to have like the the larger pillow, and those are what I really really like wanted to thrift uh, the pillowcases from. This is the kind of size I'm talking about, a square one. So lucky me, I got these ones for 20 shillings each. So these ones, you can find them quite a number. Quite a number of places you can find like these ones. So let me show you that short video that I took of the place, the fish market place of where you can find quite a number of things from. Let's check that video. that area you'll find quite a number of uh, mamas down with their thrifted items and you can actually thrift quite a number of things from them so that is one set i also got this set i have washed but not ironed so this one i got it just as one piece let me tell you my plan when i find a print that i like and it is of the same print like both sides the same print so this is what i do i come and split this one into two so i take down this print so that i have this side and this side then i go again with one color for the behind i have this um, cotton fabric that i always get from um, river road so i go take the measurement so i buy this one and then this other side after taking it down 
I use this one for this other side, sew it in, make a pillowcase that is of the same print for both sides. Let me show you something that I did. So I bought this print, or rather I bought this piece of material that I thrifted. It was quite a big piece of material. The mamas that sell uh, things like pillowcases and material, they, when you thrift you'll actually find quite a number of things from that place. So I got this kind of print from the mama. So I came and I also bought this one from River Road. So I came, matched it like that. And now I have a pillowcase. I did put a zipper. And now I have a pillowcase. Pretty cool. So I made this one. I also made another one, this one. Two smaller ones for the bed. And then I made a larger one, this one, this one, the rectangle pillowcase, and then I made another one, this one, the other one, the rectangle one. So two rectangle one, two of them, and then two smaller ones. So when I'm doing the bed, I'm doing this one plus simply a white one and sometimes when I lack white ones I use this um, white from um, River Road make pillowcases then just put them on my bed so that's the plan I'm planning to do with this pillowcase that I got totally love the print this one that one was uh, 20 shillings same color both sides same color both sides also 20 shillings and this is the print the print so that's another one and then I saw this one this print was also 20 shillings planning to do the same thing then I also got this one same print both sides why I bought this print is because it's because of this uh, bedding that we bought a while back the this uh, bed sheet they're not going to match but baby girl They have like this 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 color here this one this color and i'm sure when i do the thing they're going to look warm so with this print this one comes with this other color over here this one and when i do the thing now this bed sheet will be having two pillowcases for it so uh, did I say the price all the pillowcases 20 shillings each so another one is this one this one I was not I was not about to leave it this one is also one it's pretty large and it is the same print both sides so this one was also one so that's it for the pillowcases let's do the throw blanket this time round I bought a brown one this one I'm not going to open it a large one and this one was 350 this one I got from the mamas that were selling along uh, the fish marketplace so this is how it looks like it's very soft very 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 soft both sides soft both sides this side and this side 
So on to the last item that I got and I only got one of it, a duvet cover. And this is the number of the guy that I will leave down in the description box. This is it. It has texture. It's white in color. So this one was 400 bob. It's big. So one side is just normal cotton. Then this other side has texture. What I loved about it is that it had detailed. There's this, there's this guide right here that has buttons all the way down all the way down buttons so it's quite quite big it's a 7 by 6 size So I guess that's it for the haul, that's it for the items that we bought from Gikombara. So I'm sure I was helpful with the directions, with the contacts this time round. If you see a plug and there are contacts, well and good. If you see a plug where there are no contacts, girl, I'll have tried to get contacts, but what can I do? The owners they don't want contacts to give out their contacts so i guess that's it for this video thank you so much guys for watching if you like more of this content kindly please don't forget to subscribe and share it with your friends so i'll be sure to catch you guys in my next one so until then bye